I'm sure Sheriff Breaker wouldn't mind me borrowing this. Read me, Anderson. I read you. Have you had our frequency this entire time? Eavesdropping is a big part of the job. But no, I got it from your partner. Anderson, look for a fuse to replace the blown out one in the fuse box. That should get the power going again. Yeah. On it. Another cult stash? You? Anderson? Hold your fire! I'm coming in! Hey, Anderson. Like what I've done with the place? Hmm. Could use a bit more glide. <sighs> Funny. How are you holding up? Give me that worried look, Anderson. It's just a, it's a flesh wound. <laughs> Gave me a chance to have a, a nice chat about ex-wives with uh, Kieran. Uh, Agent Estevez, I mean. Making new friends, huh? I'm jealous. Are you sure you're okay? Yeah, I'm fine. What's the situation on your end? Watery turned out to be a good lead. Found the clicker and the cult. But the horror story's changing reality. Like Wake said it would. Logan, she's, uh... The story claims she died here. But we can stop it. Wait, Saga. 
What are you, um... Logan is gone. She has been. For a long time. Casey's affected by the horror story, too. I'm fighting for them all now. What happened at the hotel? Wake was telling the truth about the cult being after him. The thing, the dark presence, it's real, too. I saw it. A fucked up monster cloud. Wake tried to warn me. It knocked me out. FBC found me in the woods later. I'm gonna fix this, Casey. You, Logan, all of it. I just need to get the power back on first. Yeah, give him hell, Anderson. Just remember, some things in life can't be fixed with a light switch. As for the power problem, here. I found a fuse on those poor bastards there. I'll take care of it. Stay put, Casey. I'll let you know when it's safe. I'm not going anywhere. <clears throat> Anderson, good news, bad news. You can get to the cell block now, but the shaded hostels that were in there are on the loose. Thanks for the heads up. is under control, Estevez. Coming back up. Copy. Anderson, over here. Got a little cramped in that closet. 
Is the FBC sending any help? <sighs> we were the help. Well, us and the lake house. But we still have bureau gear specifically engineered to fight this threat. It's stored in the back lot. We were setting it up when the Taken interrupted us. We have light arrays, a containment cell, etc., etc. We are not out of this fight yet. What's going on? We had a hell of a time avoiding those Taken. Ended up back here. Anyway, I wanted to warn you that we have the Coscula brothers in the cells as well. They're the ringleaders of the Cult of the Tree. Don't let your guard down. What's at the lake house? It's a Bureau Research Facility at Cauldron Lake set up to study the effects of this AWE. When I got into town, I went there for backup. The whole station is lost, taken by the shadow. Lost a lot of agents. Barely got out myself. Wish me luck. According to the Luck and Probability Department, it's statistically bad luck to wish people good luck during a crisis. Thanks. An electrical lock system with no failsafe. Smart. Saga! Fucking FBI, FBC, you government fucks all fucking this up for us! Let us the fuck out! You're the leaders of the cult. You're not going anywhere. Wake will ruin everything. Get rid of him, Saga! You fucking shot me! Typical government stooge. Let me out so I can kill him, that fucker! We can take care of this. We've been preparing for this. I don't have the key. Saga, do you have it? I have the clicker. You will fix this. You will save my daughter. Promise me. Yes, I promise. But we're out of time. Hurry! Give it to him! Get it, get it. He's a fucking monster, Saga! There it is! We've been waiting for you, motherfucker! I'm gonna fucking destroy you!
These must power the light array. I need to find more. I need more time. Scratches wakes double. He tricked us. He almost got the clicker from me. The whole plan has gone out the window. How could we get this so wrong? Textbook boondoggle. You said it, Anderson. It's a shit show. So what's the plan? Scratch pretended to be Wake to trick us. He almost won me over. I should have trusted my gut. I had a bad feeling about him when we found him at the lake. When that insane monster cloud came at me in the woods, I saw a face inside it. Wake's. I think he was always a monster. Always Scratch. The FBC usually handles stuff like this, right? Any thoughts? Hold up. You brought a paranatural object in here without telling me and then almost handed it over to a hostile entity? I didn't know if I could trust you. That was a mistake. So was believing Scratch. But it's not too late. <sighs> I just need to understand more. <laughs> you got that right. Let's start acting like we're on the same side, yeah? So tell me what I'm missing. The FBC must know something. Good news, we have Bureau intel on all of this. Bad news, it's highly classified. Good news, consider yourself deputized into the Federal Bureau of Control. Here's a key to the cell where we keep the files. Happy reading. Okay. Um, thanks. Go team. The horror story's changing reality. It made it so my daughter died here, even though she's supposed to be back home in Virginia. 
Do you know if that's... Uh... AWEs are localized distortions of reality. The area outside town might not be affected. Sometimes they expand, sometimes they fizzle out. If we can make sure it's the latter, your kid might be fine. The whole thing is a nightmare. I can't let my family be torn apart. Having family isn't easy in this line of work. The late nights, travel, alternate realities threatening their existence. My ex-wife couldn't take it. Karen, you're better off without her. I know I am. You really don't remember Logan living in Virginia with me and David? Uh, I remember you and David having problems. You needed a break. You and Logan moved to Watery and... And then, uh... Then Logan... Well, that awful thing happened. After you came back to work, I thought you'd be the perfect partner for this case. If you were willing to return to the area. Okay. That's enough. The story is changing your memories. What you're remembering is fiction. Logan is alive. I'm not divorced. We never moved here. I remember the truth. No, no, no. Wake or Scratch, whoever that was, said the story could be used to attack us. We all need to question what's real. With that said, how do we know the story isn't giving you false hope? I can't convince them. I just need to change the story. Uh, this is the kind of case my ex hated. No one that might kill me. <sighs> That's funny. The cases that might kill me were my ex's favorite. Wake isn't the first person the Dark Presence disguised itself as. The lake is a gateway to the Dark Place. What the hell is a para-utilitarian? You were the better Koska, much better than me. Ugh. 
Si arco. I'm sorry about your brother, Elmo. Yaku was all heart. He always went along with my ideas, no matter how stupid they were. Always happy to help. I got carried away. I never think things through. It's my fault. I realize it's a bad time. But I need you to tell me everything about the cult of the tree. The cult is my craziest idea that ever worked. Look, what kind of a cult calls themselves a cult? Exactly. We protect water in Bright Falls. We're the good guys. A secret neighborhood watch. Well, that was the idea anyways. Look, we've always known about the horror inside the lake. When any Taken come out, we kill them. You don't turn people into Taken. You kill the ones who already have. You were trying to kill Alan Wake. Why? Nothing good has ever come out of Cauldron Lake. The nightmare that hit Bright Falls in 2010 was all because of his writing. And ever since then, pages of his stories are floating up from the lake, and monsters keep popping out. It's all him, Wake. And if we don't stop him, no one will. Wake's evil doppelganger scratches the threat we're facing. Not Wake and I will stop him. I've never heard of anyone called Scratch. How long has the cult been around for? Certain folks around here have always known about Cauldron Lake. Before us, it was the Torchbearers. And when I inherited the mission, I wanted to call it a cult. <laughs> it was genius. Just a name did half the work. Made people too scared to go into the woods at night. Business 101, fear, is a great motivator. I can tell something is wrong. What's happening to Casey? I'm a goner. Swell. A shadow crawling under my skin. In my head. Call my ex. Tell her I'm sorry. Terminal case, Casey. Something is wrong with him. He's hurt worse than he says. He's scared. Scratch was pretending to be awake, manipulating me. What does he want from me? No, I'm in control here. It's my mind place. He's powerful, too powerful. Just his presence here makes me feel sick, like a wave of terror through my head. I feel his single-minded drive to get the clicker. I assumed Wake escaped the dark place. Is it possible he's still there? The big apple in an ocean of darkness. Gone diving. Note from my editor. You're using the wrong tense. Trapped in a loop. My friends will meet him when I'm gone. Wake is still trapped in the dark place. Maybe he always was. Almost said the cult kills Taken. Is he telling the truth? Surplus deer masks by on bulk. We've got a floater, a Taken on the shore. Call the gang, Yako. We are going hunting. Cult of the tree. Keeping the town safe since 2013. Elmo is telling the truth about the cult. They really were fighting the Taken. 
We're on the same side. If the cult is killing Taken, then why did Nightingale turn into one? Private party. Invitation only. Wrong time. Wrong place. Time to go, Yako. A job half done isn't done at all. Nightingale became a Taken because the Bookers interrupted their ritual. I already took care of all this. Figured all this out already. So this goes here, and that goes there. Wake is trapped in the dark place. He's been reaching out, communicating with me in the overlaps. I need to know what information I can still trust. No. <clears throat> Think, Saga. The clicker amplifies any changes to reality suggested by a piece of art. Makes them permanent. The dark presence is vulnerable against bright light. At least that makes sense.
Scratch told me the clicker can be used to change the story. Does that match your understanding of this thing? Yeah, the light switch is a paranatural item, maybe even an object of power. We have verified reports that Alan Wake was in possession of it during the AWE here back in 2010. It definitely has power. We know that much. I can come up with a plan. I always do. So the cold of the tree actually kills Taken. They were on our side, even if their methods are misguided and criminal. It looked right from where we were standing. Nothing's what it seems in this case. Too many stories contradicting each other. Too many versions of the truth. We have a lot of catching up to do after this thing is all over. Everything is different now. My family, me, the whole fucking world. I'll buy the coffee, Anderson. Partners to the end. This case is one for the books. I see what you did there. The clicker can fix this, but I can't use it without Wake. Tor knows about this stuff. Maybe he can help. Wake is still in the dark place. How do I get him out? We live and breathe rock and roll. From the silence of screams, from the fever of dreams. The clicker can amp up other works of art, not just Tom's writing. Anything created with passion. The dark power of the lake will make it creep into reality. But. If the holder of the clicker believes in the art, they can make it all come true in the flick of a switch. I can use the clicker without Wake. Only Wake's writing can change the horror story. But I can use the clicker to change something else. Like getting Wake out of the dark place. Wake told me the clicker would fix this. But Wake was actually Scratch. How can I trust anything he said? The artist must conclude his work. He rides a storm on your piece. Wake up and smell the danger. We told you already, kiddo. What Tom said about the light switch is true. Don't let the story confuse you. You need him to write the ending you want. The clicker can make that ending come true. But we don't have Wake. Everything we knew about the Clicker was true. He wasn't lying. I will use the clicker to change reality, and bring Wake back at Cauldron Lake. I'll need the right work of art, but that won't be a problem. Uh. 
Hello, and welcome to Coffee World, Botage Washington's best coffee-themed amusement park. All of our attractions are family-friendly and available to children of all ages, just like our coffee. So, take a sip of our Oh Dear Diner organic coffee and let the adventure begin! Hold on for dear life on the Espresso Express! Oh! Soak in some local history at the Huatari Well, where two serial killers once hid the disemboweled bodies of their murder victims. It's not a haunted. <laughs> Come join Mocha Moose and the goats at our amusement park thing. Just don't share your coffee with the goats. <laughs> Seriously, stop feeding our goats coffee. Seriously, it's not amusing. Take in amazing views from the slow roaster Ferris wheel. I can almost see the Warrior Lighthouse trailer park. This is so much fun! And finish off at our beautiful gift shop where seniors and children under 10 receive a 9% discount on keychains and propane tags. Welcome to Coffee World! We guarantee you'll jaw a great time! Got it now. I just need to tell the others what to do and fix everything for good. So we need Wake to fix the story, right? That hasn't changed. So here's what I have. Wake's still trapped in the dark place under the lake. I think we can use the clicker to get him out. But first, we need a work of art, something other than his story. And that'll get him here. I'm not filling out the paperwork for this one. I wouldn't know where to start. But I'm sold. Okay. Look, this feels like something that once we get the ball rolling, there's no turning back. You sure you have it all figured out? Not just yet. Give me a moment. Okay, Anderson. You let me know when you're ready. Ready to go? I'm ready to head to Cauldron Lake now. Let's get the plan started. Okay, here we go. We'll be there for you. What do you need from us? I'll head to Cauldron Lake with the clicker. Scratch, we'll try to get you, Anderson. You'll need backup. I can tell there's no talking you out of coming, Casey. Estevez, is there a way to get that light array to the lake? Oh, I've got you covered, so good news there. And we'll bring our mobile containment unit. It's specially built for entities like Scratch. And this work of art, Anderson. What's the plan for that? I'll make some calls on the way. Just meet me at Cauldron Lake. Hey, Alex. It'll be easier on you to ride with us. We'll have waterfront parking. I like the sound of that. Tor, I need the old gods of Asgard. I need a very special song. Hell yeah! The tour bus is already loaded, and we've said our goodbyes. 
ready to hit the road. Just like the old times, baby. You saw this coming, huh? Of course. I need a song about Alan Wake. About bringing him out of the dark place. A writer. A lake of darkness. Bringing him into the light. <laughs> it writes itself. I hope they've still got it. David, please pick up. David. David! It's me. Where have you- Stop. For once, you need to listen. You left me. You took my daughter away from me. Then you let her- She's dead because of you. And I don't ever want to hear your voice again. Stop calling me. David! Jesus Christ. It's getting worse. It's spreading. I'm running out of time. up on the shore. We need to be ready if Scratch shows up. We'll be ready. Send the bed out.
Another cult box. be opened on this side. That must be Torn Odin. Maybe I should check in. Kiddo! We're almost at the gig! And Odin's run over four minions of darkness! <laughs> the boss is our hammer! I'm driving with one hand! I need you to meet me at the shore. Is the song ready? Almost! Odin's got a killer coral tree! Tree! Drive carefully, Grandpa. Pedal to the metal, bro. Metal to the pedal.
The lights in the containment cell are good to go, Anderson. Great. A Torin Ode in there yet? <laughs> the two golden oldies? Oh, they're here. And they bought moonshine. I love them already. <laughs> they're a lot. You wanted to know what art we would use? Well, that's them. I'll be there soon. One, two. One, two. is we were in a hurry. The power supply is spotty. Your partner here will try to keep it running. But I, I'm not a damn mechanic. I wish your tech guy was here, Karen. <sighs> Grandpa, you signal me when the song is done, and I'll use the clicker to bring Wake back. Hit it! Hello, Cogren Wake! Great to see so many federal agents here tonight. Prepare to experience a soul searing mind frying act of black magic and sorcery. This song goes out to our favorite tortured writer. Let these sweet tunes guide you out of the darkness. It's called Dark Ocean Summer Name. Uh, let's try that again. <laughs> uh. A whole lot of paranormal crimes happening right now. It's fucking awesome. I want a t-shirt. The show's drawing a crowd. Take an incoming, Anderson.
lot of paranatural crimes happening right now. It's fucking awesome. I want a t-shirt. The show's drawing a crowd. Taking incoming, Anderson.
international crimes happening right now. That's fucking awesome. I want a t-shirt. Show's drawing a crowd. Take an incoming, Anderson.
happened? Why didn't it work? I did everything right. Art to bring him back? Clicker to make it real? So where the fuck is he? presence had stopped me. I had seen the title page of another manuscript. Return. I didn't remember writing it, but it felt familiar. Important. I had to find it. a new draft of initiation to reach Parliament Tower using another murder site. Scratch was reaching out from the dark place to get Alice. She was out, but still in danger. something I was back and I hadn't died. forgotten is, is I knew how this worked now I could take control no more surprises what demons he wrestles with in the dark hours of the night together with our house band the divine old gods of Asgard we have created something very special the song is called Herald of Darkness but I like to call this next segment the story of the journey of Alan Wake the musical just do what we always do. We'll chat, but instead of talking, we'll sing it! You grew up nice and sheltered with mama's pretty stories and you're all made up pure And mama gave me a magic clicker Well, yes, I think it's true and fair to say
And the award goes to... Alan White! And all your stories of crime and chilling thrillers Of hard-boiled killers became bestsellers It was all too much, I had to get away
That was pretty good. A vision. Such a dark place am I trapped in here? Is this real I cannot remember? Was a manuscript it held a key a vicious cycle i must not surrender to echo seems to seek out again and again until i figure it out to bring this song to its end
And I thought this place couldn't get any stranger.